What's up? Welcome back to our channel. I'm Caitlin. And I'm Kala. And these are our friends. Hi, I'm Kyle. I have a YouTube channel called Pizza Time Reviews. Maybe you've seen them. Check Maybe. them out. <laughs> and then we'll tag his YouTube channel down below. But this is my friend Emma. And we've been friends since high school. And she's here visiting. And the dogs are drinking water. Always. So if you're new here, that happens every time in every video. So it just happened early on in this one. So our friends are in town. Well, Kyle lives here, and then Emma's in town. Um, and so we were, we knew we were gonna get a treat tonight. And I was like, Yo, is this an opportunity for a YouTube video? <laughs> so I, we went to Crave, and this is all I think our first time having Crave. Yeah, I've never had it. I think, I think I've, I've had, had it, but I've never gone there. So this is our first time going there, spending our own money on some cookies, and they're similar to Crumble. But we're gonna have like a taste test review. How Crave does on their cookies. So this is a taste review with some of our besties. Okay, here's the box. Got that gold. You so you gotta know this is a fancy place. Gold foil. <laughs> I don't love it. Um Okay, here's the cookies. I'm trying not to like get them too crazy. Is the lighting terrible? A little bit, but we're gonna roll it. Oh burn! Did you see his little nose in the <laughs> Okay, so Okay, so yeah, there we go, guys. Boom, baby. Okay, guys, presentation wise, what, what, are, we what are we thinking? So we've got a Samoa cookie. Which is like a Girl Scout one. Which is like the Samoa Girl Scout cookies. We've got a Better Than XXX cookie. Better Than What? <laughs> we've got a Biscoff. Biscoff cookie. And we've got a Cinnamon Pop -tart, Pop Tart cookie. cookie. The Biscoff one looks like doughy and like 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 kind of under baked. Yeah, and like I, under it doesn't cooked. look fully cooked right now. But like I'm kind of into that. Yeah, me too. I think it, it looks would be good. good. To me. It'll look gooey. But I'll tell you what. What got me to crave is the better than what cookie, which is chocolate caramel sauce, whipped cream topping, and toffee. I know I already like that. That cookie's kind of looking overdone to me, but there's Isn't frosting it? and stuff on it. Yeah. So that's what it took me there is the better than what cookie? The I'm, Samoa one has a lot of coconut. What are you thinking? I don't love coconut, <laughs> but this isn't about me. Yeah. So I'm going to try it. Okay. We're going to see how it is. I'm, I'm going to see if I, I think, can do it. I think I'm most excited about the Pop-Tart, Cinnamon Pop-Tart. Really? Okay, you were the one that were Just like, because I'll it, that. I mean, cinnamon sounds good. It looks good. Like, yeah. I'm excited. It looks the best. It does. The other, it's just simple. Like visually, it's simple. like it's it's like all it's put together. Everyone else has like a lot of stuff going yeah, on. Yeah, a lot going on. I think the chocolate one looks the best. Like whoever did that swizzle of whipped cream killed it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I guess we'll cut into it and get started. All right, we got our cookies all cut up and given out to each person. Definitely so, doing a cookie review is definitely a four person thing. Yeah. Because they cut really well in fourths. <laughs> any any more than that or any less than that, that's a weird amount of numbers. Yeah. Like true. And threes or fives, <laughs> can't do that. So we each have a like a fourth of each cookie and we're gonna rate it on a scale of one through ten, because that's how you want pizza reviews. So it only makes sense. Yep. Um so which one should we go which one should we try first? Save the best for last or go best first? I'm always the best well, for last. Kind best of so are we saving the pop tart one for last then? Yeah. Well, let's go with more. I'm, I'm gonna, let's try the chocolate one. Okay. 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 That's a yes for me. That's a 10. 10, 10. It's the whipped cream. That's good. The cookie soft. <laughs> like, yeah, that's really good. Mm -hmm. I like this one a lot. It tastes like a brownie too. Yeah, it does. Okay. Yeah, I love that. But I knew this is the this is why I came. This one's not like too sweet either. Yeah, it's it's really Actually, got good flavors. Maybe it's the whipped cream frosting like. The whipped cream, cream is not great. super like. Mm -hmm. It's the caramel sauce that's the sweet. It has a little crunch to it. My mom used to make this cake a lot when I was growing yeah. up. Yeah. Nostalgic. So, yeah, it really brings me back to like when I was a kid. So I like this one a lot. That one was really good. I, out of 10, I'd probably give it a, probably like an 8.7. Whoa! Whoa. Yeah. yeah, mine's pretty high too. I, I was going to say 8.5. Dang. Yeah. Like, I thought it was really balanced and really good. Yeah. And I think, like, everything just, like, came together really well. Yeah, you're right. I was going to say an 8. 
Perfect. Yeah, it's all my 10, and this is the best cookie. Um, I thought the cookie was soft. I, I love, love soft cookies. I love the I love like whipped cream anything, so like of course that's a yes for me. So. And some cookies are like kind of crazy and it's like too much, but that wasn't too much. It was just like yeah. it was a good cookie. Yeah, oh, I mean like the cookie was soft, the whipped cream was light, the heat was like crunchy, so it had like a lot of things going for it that worked really well together. Yo, that cookie was bomb. Next. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we're doing the Samoa, the coconut one next just to get it out of the way so Kyle can just be done with it. And we all have some milk so that we can cleanse our palates. Yeah, I already cleansed mine. I'm going in, guys. Hi. <laughs> I love it. I think I got most of the small cookie in there. This is bomb. I love it. 10 10 for me. <laughs> that was good. Did you like this one or the other one better? I have them both the same. Okay. <laughs> Oh, burn! Did you did he do the scene? <laughs> I it love it. It's not bad. I like the other one better, but it's not bad. Like it's. It's, it's better good. than I thought it would be. We got it out of the way for you. Yeah, well, so I mean, the cookie part is fine. I just personally don't like coconut. So if it was like anything else, I think I would really like it. Yeah, it's but, a it's a sugar cookie, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I think like the chocolate and the cookie part <laughs> are pretty good. Plate. I just. I can't do coconut, but I know. for people who enjoy Samoa cookies, I think this is going to be yeah very popular. And what you thinking? It's good. It's simple, but the the mix is good. Um, it tastes just like a Samoa to me, and I love Samoas, so that's mm -hmm. why I like it. Yeah. Gosh, I like both of them. What's your rating? Let's you go. You go. I give it a seven one. It wasn't bad, but it wasn't great. It was kind of just. Very coconutty. Let me try. It. And I, I love like coconut. coconut, so that's. Let me try. It's a little too much coconut for me. Yeah, I mean, I would probably give it a, a five, and that's just because I don't like coconut. But I thought the other components were very. Dan, that's a high well. number for not liking coconut. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm just trying to be not biased. Fair. Yeah. Yeah. Well, just because I don't like coconut doesn't mean like. I mean, you guys all like it, so it's fine. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go with a six. It was good. Tasted just like a Girl Scout cookie. Just like. But yeah. There's actually a Girl Scout cookie underneath all that. Yeah? I didn't get any of that. I think I got like half. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I liked it. 10-10. Ten, 10-10. Ten. Ten, ten. I would ten. get it again. Yeah, I loved it. 10 out of 10. Would recommend to a friend. I probably wouldn't buy it again. I would get it again. I loved it. My mom would love that. She loves those kind of cookies. Next it's up, we're going drink. with the Biscoff. Mm -hmm. Biscoff is next. I'm a little nervous. This is like, whoa! Are there marshmallows in there? Is this marshmallow? Maybe. Maybe. There's white stuff in it. It's uh, very fragile. It's like Delta times a million. Yeah, like this is straight out the airplane. Whoa! Like, yeah. It is rich too. Like, mm -hmm. if you had a cavity, that would be. <laughs> that would be like stinging. <laughs> Dang, I don't know. I like it though. Like I like the taste of Biscoff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's just a lot. A lot sweeter than the last two, I feel I like. I just got like a chunk of Biscoff cookie. Yeah, like you really need milk with this one. Like I could not eat a whole one of these by myself. Like, yeah, one bite's enough. Yeah. I don't think there's anything baked in it. Like that just kind of It's very like, soft. Yeah. It's like they took the dough and smashed it to a circle. Well, and, and also I don't think this one is baked fully. Yeah. Like it's it's pretty raw looking in the middle. I mean that might just be how it it's supposed they, to be, but they probably want it like that. Yeah. It's good though. I personally like my cookies under baked, so I like that. Yeah. But there was just a little bit too much biscoff. Like it was intense. Hit us with the with the rating. I would give that uh 7.6 I feel like I needed a lot of milk after that Me Yeah, there's just a lot of sugar yeah. Like that one is definitely <gasps> Hey Hey, that's not bad Wow, Good that could have been worse Thanks, you, you saw it here, folks <laughs> Action shot um, I would probably give it a 7.2 Like it was really rich, like you need milk with that mm -hmm. But, I mean, it was for having a fourth of a cookie, that was pretty good. Yeah, yeah. I'd say seven too. I also like the cookie dough, the underbaked cookie, so it was good. 
good bite, but very rich. Yo, I love that episode. I think I'm gonna say like 8.5. That was <laughs> that was good. Like, not a 10, 10. Not I'm a 10, 10. <laughs> Only because like that was like that was a lot, and I only took like two bites of my fourth of cookie. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like it was so rich, but I liked it. Like I'd buy it again. I'd buy it again. A fourth was good for me. I mean, I I definitely get it again, but hopefully someone would split it with me. Mm -hmm. I will say, like these are definitely like they feel like deluxe cookies. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like even like a step up from like your regular midnight cookie place. Mm -hmm. Okay, we saved the the best for last. Uh, like what we think. We think we saved the best for last. Oh, the yeah. cinnamon pop tart, and it's a fat cookie, and there's like in the center is cinnamon sugar. And vanilla icing on top, so I hope you guys were right. This is the cookie <laughs> that Emma, Kyle, and I were most excited for. I was trying to get when we saw it on the I was trying to get a different one, but <laughs> <laughs> if I picked the other three. <laughs> hmm. <gasps> That's not bad. <laughs> That's pretty good. You took yeah. a cinnamon roll. Yeah, it really does. Uh, like it, it does capture like cinnamon pop tart, and I had cinnamon mm -hmm. pop tarts all the time growing up. This is better than a cinnamon pop tart by far. It doesn't got the crispy edges. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like it's very moist, even though like it is a very thick cookie. So that was a little like taken back for me. That was like that was a lot, but I love cinnamon sugar, and I think it really does taste just like a pop tart. That surprised me. I did not have high hopes for that. Yeah, that was a good surprise. Okay, hit us. The cookie's so thick that it really does like remind me of a pop tart, like mm -hmm. the outside of a pop tart. It was uh, it was good, but I don't think it was great. I would give it a seven point seven. Oh, very similar. Um, I definitely don't think it was the best cookie you had, so I'm gonna give it a seven eight. <laughs> I was like, loving. I thought you guys loved it when you ate it. No, like it was good, but I think it's just too thick. Too okay. thick. Okay. You know like when you eat the edges of a pop tart and it's just like the outside? Yeah. Yeah. That's kind of how it was. Like really? I don't, know. Like, I don't know if you can see on camera, but like there's a little bit of cinnamon sugar and then like a lot. Yeah, of that's like an that's like an inch and a half thick. And that's what that's the biggest complaint way. of what uh, was pop tart. The Okay, what are you thinking? I was gonna give it a nine and a half. Whoa! I liked I just it. Wanted uh, yeah, I liked it too. Yeah. It was like, yeah. That chocolate one was so good. Though. It was good. <sighs> Guys, I don't even know. I liked it though. <laughs> I'm gonna say like a, I think like a eight, an eight. What did I say about Biscoff? An eight point five. Yeah. I think I'm gonna give this an eight. An eight. Okay. But so I like that. I would, I would get this one again. I would get <laughs> all four of these cookies again. I probably wouldn't get the Samoa cookie again, but definitely the better than what I would get again. That's my pick. That was the reason why we went. That one might have been good. my favorite. I know how to take them, guys. That's a good one. That was a good one. Okay, Kyle's idea was to like talk about like overall crave. 10 10 man i don't care about those other cookie places i'm crave for life honestly <laughs> i mean that and they sold drinks there you know how i feel about my fun drink i would definitely say crave was a good choice i like it better than the other places but we didn't try their chocolate chip cookie and that's the one you love the most yeah and i mainly just like the regular chocolate chip cookies so I would just say I'm undecided right now. I have to try their chocolate chip cookie. You'll report back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Kyle. Yeah, I really liked it. I thought it, it had a lot of good variation. I mean, you see so many cookie shops popping up these days, and right. sometimes they kind of have the same flavors, just <laughs> Copy, different rotations. Modified. Yeah, and I know like Crumble, they use like the same base for most of their cookies. Yeah. So I felt like this one had a lot of variation, and they put a lot of care into like how they put their ingredients together. So I liked it, I'd definitely go again. Yeah. Wow, good review. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was a good treat. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't have much to say more than that, but it was a good snack. Yeah, good. Very much enjoyed. So yeah. Yeah. I'd go back. Crane is my new cookie spot, for sure. Easy. <laughs> I'll jump ship just like that. <laughs> I'm so glad we went. I really like the cookies. And they, I think they're similar to like where they change their menu once a week and they post mm -hmm. it on Instagram and tell you like what they have. So 
Um, I loved all four of these, and I, I know they have like other crazy awesome cookies, so I might have to be uh, looking on the menus once a week just to <laughs> see what's going on. But anyways, yeah, we really like these. Yeah, thank you guys for the treat. It was fun. Yeah, it's very really great. All right, guys, that's it for our cookie review of Crave. We had a really good time, and we found some really good cookies. Um, let us know if you've had Crave, what your favorite flavor is there. Uh, or if you don't have Crave and you like other local uh, cookie spots like Crumble or Chip or Nocturne or whatever the other one is, let us know what you like in the comments. So one time, Caitlin and Claw and I, we did a review of Domino's. You can check that out on our channel in the link right I mean, here. Somewhere over here. Maybe. We'll see. Um, Kyle was gracious enough to let us pick Domino's, which is Caitlin's favorite pizza. That's my favorite, favorite pizza, pizza place. It was 10-10. Right. It was 10-10. I kind of would have picked a different one. I don't know about that night, but it was like pretty, it was like really good, that Domino's that night, even though it was an hour and a half late. Ooh, I it, forgot about it that. Took, it took so it long. It took a long time. But that was a fun review with my friends. Go check it out. Pizza yeah. Time Reviews, Instagram, YouTube, wherever you want to find us. And if you're dying to know her Instagram, <laughs> Emma Kimmett, <laughs> at Emma Kimmett. So, anyways, thanks for hanging out with us and following along, and have a great day. See, See ya. ya.